Hi, welcome to Holly's Inspiration Station. And we're back with another video with um, there with finding different ways uh, to entertain the dementia. Uh, starring my mom, her name is Barbara. Say hi. Look, look at the camera, say hi. Okay. And um, what we're gonna do today is we're going to give her um, a hand massage, okay? And then uh, tomorrow I'm gonna do something to completely different, but we're gonna start off with the hand massage and stay no. tuned till the end because at the end of the healing session with my mom on ways yeah. to entertain the dementia, I'm going to give um, an Archangel Michael Oracle card reading, okay? So let's go. All right, so I'm gonna, all right, here we go, mom. All right, we'll start off with, okay, so we'll start off with this hand, okay. So, <coughs> and then we'll just, you know, this is, this is really nice for them. It's very, very therapeutic. It's very healing. So, I mean, normally you would see anybody else wearing gloves, but I'm not wearing gloves because my mom's my family, I'm not wearing any gloves. So, um, but not wearing gloves is, is good too, because what happens is I'm sharing my energy with my mom, you know, I'm giving her good energy. So, um, what happens is, you know, and I said it before and I'll say it again. What happens is when you are blessed with, you know, good energy and you have an abundant flow of it um, and you share it, you know, with the right people. Um, and you know what? Um, God source universal energies will um, bless you right back with more. So, I mean, and then there's recharging, too. So you can like go out in nature and ground and, you know, put your bare feet you know on the grass and and ground and then there's also other ways of recharging too so um all right and uh there are lots of ways to recharge and you know get your energy back such as um oh water is very healing you know you step into the shower take a bath uh water is very healing too as well so So after this massage, like I was saying before, after the, I give my mom the hand massage, um, I'm going to um, break out my um, Archangel Michael healing oracle cards. And I haven't really, okay, wanna, okay, mom wants to do this hand now. She's had enough of that hand. So mom, mom wants to do this hand. All right. You don't really need that much. I mean, this is really good stuff though. It's got, um, lavender and vanilla it's got essential oils so it's it's really good stuff it's it's aromatherapy it's an aromatherapy um natural essential oils um uh, hand lotion it's got shea butter and vitamin e yeah. it's really good and it's relaxing and you know what the people who have dementia they really enjoy this very relaxing mm -hmm. it's very relaxing and then I was thinking of the next video that I make um because I was thinking with the next video that I'm going to um give my mom a foot massage I'll just use the same stuff because it smells really nice the lavender and the vanilla smell really nice So how is everybody feeling today? I hope everyone is feeling well. All right, we are almost done. We're almost done. See, earlier before I gave my mama a manicure, I had to trim her nails. I don't know if you could see, but I had to, yeah, let me see him. All right, so I had to um, trim her nails and they were like getting long and I had to trim them and I filed them. 
I filed them down and I took care of that. So her nails are held at a healthy length where um, she won't, like when she goes and scratches her, you know, if she gets an itch or something, she won't um, accidentally scratch herself. So it all, it all works out. How does that make you feel, Barbara? The hand massage. Oh. I have to call her Barbara. She's my mom and it's the hardest thing, but she doesn't respond to mom anymore. The, the name mom, she only responds to Barbara. So that's how it is when they have dementia, you know? They forget who they are. If they, they tend to forget who you are. See, my mother doesn't know who I am anymore. But that's all right. I've come to acceptance with it. In the beginning, it was difficult, but I've come to acceptance with it. It's all good. How you liking these healing hands, Barbara? Yeah. <laughs> good, right? <laughs> I got good energy and I'm sharing with you. All right. You're well taken care of. And tomorrow we're gonna we're gonna use the same lotion and we're gonna massage your feet, all right? And maybe we'll even paint your toenails. But I know tomorrow I was thinking of tomorrow painting my mom's fingernails tomorrow. And then after that I was, you know, thinking about giving um a bonus card reading. I haven't really decided on what um oracle oracle cards to use, but um I'll go over them and um I'll let my higher self pick out the oracle cards for tomorrow because I trust my higher self. Everybody has a higher self, by the way. Okay, so um, here are the Archangel Michael Oracle cards. I don't know if you can see that. All right. And then, um, again, by Doreen Virtue. Okay. Yeah, get ready for a reading. Yeah. It's going to be nice. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. All right, so we are going to shuffle the Archangel Michael cards. We're going to give the cards a good shuffle, all right? Yeah. And we're going to find out, not just for you, not just for me, but if, if the, for the, the collective as well, and see what kind of um, messages Archangel Michael would like for, to, for us to hear today. Okay? So sit back and relax and enjoy the show. <laughs> All right. Well, that one wanted to pop out. Oh, I should have, yeah. right? That one wanted to pop out. That's the surprise card. <laughs> That one wanted to pop out. I want to give these cards a good shuffle. Okay. We got some good energies here. Okay. No, no, no. Don't do that, Barbara. Don't. Okay. Sometimes we run into situations like this. Okay. Where, you know, she'll get a little bit antsy. But that that's how, the de that, that's how it is, you know. With the dementia, they get a little antsy. It could be time for her nap, so I gotta, I gotta um, push, push forward a little bit, um, a little bit faster with this. But I like to take my time with this. Up, oh, okay. So we're going to cut the deck. You watching, Mara? You watching? Yeah, check it out. We're gonna, we're gonna cut the deck. All right. I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna cut the deck. All right. And now we're gonna read the cards. We're gonna give the cards three knocks. And we're gonna ask some, um, okay. And then, cool. mm-hmm. And then, okay, l watch, watch for these messages, okay? Because yeah. these are nice cards and they're fun too, okay? And Archangel Michael wants you to have fun with this, okay? So here we have, um, okay. Okay, so we ask Archangel Michael to please send us our uh, Tuesday messages to our today's uh, November 21st. 
we ask Archangel Michael to send us um, the, what messages that we need to know for today that would be inspired. Something, something inspiring, right, for today, for the 21st, okay? Let's go. I will give it uh, three more knocks. One, two, three, okay? Now, what do we have here? Spend more time outdoors. Okay, so we'll just put this one over here. And what is the next one? I'll read, I'll get back to these cards. And then the next one is explore your options. Okay. And then the next one we have is positive thoughts create positive results. Okay. Oh boy. Should we go for one more? Yes or no? Should should we go for one more? Do we have time for one yes more? Yes and no. Uh, well, yes and no. Look at that. Yes and no. Well, yes or no. Yes or no. All right. Let's go with yes. Okay. We'll we'll do we'll do a four, we'll do a four card reading. We'll go with uh, okay innocence. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. With the angel wings, are beautiful. Innocence. Okay. So we got four. Okay. We got four. So let's go to the, uh, let's see, what we have. let's go to the, the guidebook and we got four beautiful cards here. Okay. We have spend more time outdoors, but it's winter right now. So, um, but you know what, in, in this part of, um, on this part of the planet, okay. On this part of the planet. Um, it is cold over here um, in Long Island, New York. So um, if you were in, you know, a pretty much a warm, well, you could still go outdoors too. I guess it doesn't matter. Just, you know, uh, dress for it. Okay. And it says, thank you for motivating me to spend more time outdoors and for helping me relax and enjoy connecting with nature. So we are going to look up more of a meaning because um, it has more information for that card. So this is what I'll uh, check this out, Barbara. Yeah. We're gonna look. We're gonna look for the um, more information on uh, that specific message. Spend more time outdoors. It's good for your energy too. It's good. It, you know what? Speaking of recharging, right? Getting your energy back yeah. outdoors will do it. Okay, um, number seventy-eight. Here we go. Archangel Michael is sending you a message asking you to go outside and connect with nature. The fresh air will help you hear the voice of the divine more readily and clearly. And nature uh, and, and and the natural setting will... Here, hold my hand, Barbara. And the natural... You want to hold my hand? No. And the, <laughs> and the natural setting will relax and ease your body. Give and me that. okay, see, this is what happens sometimes. She's getting a little bit irritable, but that's okay. Um, look at, look, um, here, you wanna, here, you wanna hold that for me? No. It's pretty and it's made of velvet and it feels really good. Okay, so higher levels, okay, natural setting will relax and ease your body and mind. All these factors reduce stress and worry, which will enable you to attract which will you enable you to attract hold on um and manifest at higher levels think of going outside as an investment that plays huge dividends in all ways take a spiritually based journey to a power place learn a new outdoor hobby get more exercise go camping see barbara go camping or hiking take up natural nature photography Make sure your home is conductive to healthful living by detoxifying it and applying feng, sh feng shui principles. Keep plants and other natural items in your home or office. Yeah. Yeah. Say, mom says, yeah. Your life purpose involves environmentalism and or animal rights issues. Open your windows to allow fresh air into your home and office. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, now on to the next card. Yay! <laughs> All right, so, Mom, okay, so this is what happens. It's okay. This this is what happens, you know? Like, uh, things things happen. Things, you know, things that are completely out of your control. You know what? Leave it. It's out of control. It's out of your control. I can't fix this. She's holding on to it. So, you know what? Let's just go with the flow. 
All right, so explore your options is the second one. Explore your options. Let's see what explore your options has to say. Um, explore your options, uh, number, uh, page number 30, okay? Here we go. <laughs> you, <laughs> you've worked hard to make your current circumstances pal palatable, and now it's time to look at alternatives. Your coping and adaption adapt your coping and adaptation skills are admirable. However, Archangel Michael reminds you and it's important to be honest and authentic with yourself at all times. At all times and um at, at all times Okay, you don't need to compromise in any way for Michael assures you that your needs will be met in gentle and loving ways. And there's an, okay, so there are more pa uh, possible specific meanings. Mm -hmm. Update your resume and look for another job. Know that you won't be alone if you leave an unhealthy relationship. Find new ways to heal the present situation. Research and explore your options. Change the professional you change the professional you work with such as your doctor therapist lawyer and so forth allow yourself to daydream about possibilities remember that everything is possible yay that was a good one right okay so we have explore your options dear god thank you for your wisdom and love helping me to see understand and assess all of my alternative options Please guide me in the best direction for my health, happiness, and life purpose. There we go. Can you do me a favor? Can you fold that for me, Barbara? Thank you. Can you fold? You're really, you're, you're an excellent folder. Can you fold that for me? Okay, now we have card number four. I mean, yeah, card number three. We have positive thoughts create positive results. Divine love and wisdom, I call upon you now. I know that my mind and emotions are eternally and continuously connected to you. I ask my higher self to be aware and conscious of the love and light that is within every person and situation. Isn't that beautiful? Shine your light. And uh, positive thoughts create positive results. Just shine your light. You know what? Because when you, you feel good, you know, it shows. Yeah. And you know what? You carry that with you in your vibration when you feel when you feel good. All right, so let's explore more with this card. Um, Barbara, why don't you sit back and relax? Do me a favor. Can you, can you, um, uh, can you, do me a favor. Can you fold this for me? Thank you. Ex um, positive thoughts create positive results. Let's see now. Over here. Positive thoughts. Okay, where is that? Um, let's see now. Oh, here we go. Number 66. So here we have number 66. All right. Okay, there we go. Okay, here, take this, okay. Let's put it over here. This situation calls for uplifting thoughts which are the magic and greens you've been looking for. Although you may protest that you already have a positive mindset, Archangel Michael advises you to purge your thoughts and speech of any worries or other negativity that could diminish your manifestations. Michael says that you can tell how constructive your thoughts are by paying attention to recent events in your life as there is a direct correlation between positive thoughts and positive results. He'll help um, be you, buoy your spirits to a truly beneficial level so that your experiences are happy and, and welcome. Adopt a daily or hourly, hold my hand, Barbara, an hourly practice of saying positive affirmations. Read a book like I'm doing now of saying positive, read a book or take a class on positive affirmations. Avoid blaming yourself for others instead of focus on solutions rather than worrying about something. And pray and practice a loving, compassionate state of mind. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. It is, right? So we have that. Um, okay, and then we have, oh, the last one is innocence. Okay, 
Dear God and angels, thank you for helping me to see. You see the card? You see the card? All right. Dear God and angels, thank you for helping me to see that all of your qualities of pure love and light are reflected within me and all others. Help me embrace my God-given innocence so that I may be at peace. Isn't that pretty? Look, he's holding a puppy. Okay. All right, so we'll, meet, we'll read more about what um, more specific means to innocence. Yeah, you know, it's very childlike, you know? Okay, so innocence. Here we go, the last card. Um, number 48, okay? Number 48, okay. Now, oh, you want to play? Yeah, you can play with that. Okay, number 48, here we go. Last card. Archangel Michael is holding you in a comforting embrace, assuring you of your innocence. Ask him to help help you forgive. You want to wrap my arm up? Go ahead, you can do it. Get creative, Barbara. Ask him to help you forgive yourself and let go of guilt, which is a heavy emotion. Hold my hand, Barbara. Emotion that keeps you from experiencing inner peace by saying, Archangel Michael, thank you for helping me forgive myself for, and then anyone's name or specific event, you can, um, you can mention, uh, you can put that in the parentheses. And for anything else I blame myself for, please help me release all self-blame from my mind, body, and emotions. Feel the sensation of deep release as Archangel Michael helps you embrace your true innocence. Your past behavior could never un undo God's perfect handiwork in creating you as a powerful, loving, and much-needed being of light and love. The individual you're inquiring about is innocent. Purify or detoxify. You could trust the situation that you're asking about. Focus on other people's good qualities instead of their mistakes. And here we have the prayer again. Dear God and angels, thank you for helping me to see that all your qualities of pure love and light are reflected within me and all others. Help me embrace my God-given innocence so that I may be at peace. Uh, get down. Okay, so that was the last card and the last message. So, you know, when Archangel Michael had four special messages, inspirational messages for us today, and uh, they were they were great. How do you feel? I feel great. How do you feel, Barb? You feel great? Uh, I'm the need. Okay. Yes. Yes. Oh. Oh. You know what she's doing? She's playing. Yeah. She. Yes. She's uh, trying to take her sock off. She does that. She does that sometimes. She plays with her socks. Anyway. I feel like um, those were the messages that Archangel Michael wanted to uh, wanted us to hear for today. So um, I want to say thanks again for um coming in and into and tuning into this get up okay <laughs> i'm sorry mom it's like get up we got you know we're gonna after this we're gonna get up we're gonna start you know we're gonna i'm gonna take her for a ride in the wheelchair all right so um we're gonna get up we're gonna move around okay so uh this concludes um the messages for today and um thank you so much for tuning in to Hallie's Inspiration Station, your favorite inspiration station, your favorite channel. And um, my mother and myself uh, wish you all a very uh, good night and, um, and a good evening. And uh, please like, share, and subscribe. And um, take care of yourselves. Bye.